Long Beach Grand Prix just roared through Long Beach. They're racing monster trucks in Des Moines somewhere. Formula One is out there with all its big money and beautiful women and engineering. We couldn't take it. So we cracked. We went to the King Midget Grand Prix. Um, King Midgets. That's what these things are. And there were 11 of them at the Peterson Museum in Los Angeles. Okay, Dick Messer, director of the Peterson Museum, tell us, tell us what's going on here. Well, these cars aren't called King Midgets. For nothing. These, these, these cars will be the future kings of the road. Now, the way the economy's going and the way the automobile industry is going, these are one-cylinder uh, motors, uh, about uh, 250 cc's, and they're all street legal. And this is your, you're looking at your future. Uh, they don't make a hard top, so you have to be in the convertibles. But uh, these are cars, they made them from uh, 1955 to 1969, and they're called King Midgets. And this is the largest gathering of King Midgets ever on the west coast of the United States. Twelve. Here at the fabulous Peterson Museum. Again, at the, uh, the fabulous Peterson Museum. Fabulous Peterson the Museum. Fa fabulous Peterson there you go. Museum. Thank exactly. you, Dick Messer. And tell me about this uh, this race here. This is uh, like the uh, Long Beach Grand Prix of King Midgets. Uh, well, it's the first time we've done anything like this out here. This is the third Peterson meet. Uh, we have the King Midget uh, annual jamboree it tends to be back east, and that's the big King Midget event. We get uh, we get 60 to 100 King Midgets at, at those meets, but there's very few of us out here. So, very well done. Uh, so Nick. He's a King Midget fan, and he suggested that we have a uh, King Midget meet down here three years ago, and we've made it an annual event, and it's a lot of fun. And now, the racing part. This is better than rendezvous. Buckle your seatbelts and hold on for a scary run. there's more to it than just the racing. There is the potato. Imagine if Jensen Button had to stop ten times each lap and skewer a potato. He couldn't do that, could he? It was a simpler time, it was a cheaper time, it was a time when the king ruled, the king midget. For Auto Week, this is Mark Vaughn.